He is oozing machismo. The following contest is a ladder match. That is for the WWE Intercontinental and the WWE Intercontinental Championships. Making his way to the ring from Miami, Florida, weighing in at 287 pounds, the bad guy, Razor Ramon. Talk about an iconic Intercontinental Champion. Of course, he made the ladder match famous in his wars with Shawn Michaels. And don't forget, gentlemen, few superstars have been able to recover from the Razor's Edge. From fighting on the mean streets of Miami, Razor Ramon now sits on top of the world. One of the toughest men to ever step inside the ring. And HBK, San Antonio, the Texas, kid is back on Raw. Michaels, the showstopper, Mr. WrestleMania. Shawn Michaels has earned every single moniker bestowed upon him in his career. Mr. WrestleMania, the showstopper. We could go on and on, but nothing does the justice of watching Shawn Michaels perform like opening your eyes. on the line in a ladder match where the first superstar to grab the championship wins. Oh, much like sitting next to Saxton, it's easier said than done. You gotta scratch and claw. It's a question of how bad you want it. Ooh, what a damaging blow. Razor Ramon toying around with his opponent now. Into the corner he goes, a perfectly placed target. Heads out of the ring. What's next? Razor is ready to let all of us bask in his machismo. Oh, the ladder. Here we go, right in the center of the ring. A perfect place to set up that ladder. Climb, go for it, climb. Perhaps trying to get a quick victory here. Not a bad strategy. Questionable timing of this move, Cole. Oh my god! Pulled back into the hip toss. I'll just leave it at this. Nobody comes into a match hoping to get chucked around like that. That's just hard to watch. He's setting up the ladder now, but can he get up there in time? That's the question. Looking wobbly in the corner. And up the ladder we go. He is fixing to take it all here. Perhaps some wistful thinking going on there, Michael. Working his way up the ladder now. This is a critical moment. Corey, what could be the deciding factor in this matchup? You have to play offense just as well as you play defense because you're protecting yourself from being attacked with the ladder and preventing opponents from climbing. Remember, you have to be in the ring, climb the ladder, and grab the prize that's suspended in midair high above the ring. 
Yeah, you miss 100% of the shots you don't take, right? Yeah, but when you miss a shot, you don't usually fall 15 feet. The next wall up high. Wow, what a shot. And now he's continuing to fight up top. Oh, he knew what was coming. Ooh. It looked to me like a premature time to climb the ladder anyway. This opportunity is his for the take. New champ, a new era begins. Ladies and gentlemen, here is your WWE Intercontinental and WWE 